do you talk in the book about your the your really low point of a year and a half ago yeah um you do talk about that oh yeah yeah and i talk about that in the context of and uh of cancel culture i have a whole uh, chapter on cancel culture oh and, and interesting yeah yeah and um my my contention is craig stop it <laughs> stop it craig <laughs> My contention is, is that, you know, we're, um, cancel culture is zooming in on a single act. And, um, I just think as people, as people, when we're dealing with other people, whether we know them, don't know them, whatever, I think if anything unfortunate happens or anything at all, just zoom out on someone, take them as the whole, um, you know, are, do they have a pattern of, of, of nasty behavior? If so deal with that. But even then, try to teach them or, or get them to see the error of their ways, you know? And so all these things aren't revolutionary thoughts. I just, I write a little bit about it and, and I have a little experience with it. And I'm just glad I didn't get canceled, I guess, because, um, you know, I did learn from it and I think I became a better person out of it. Yeah. Um, I would think that you're certainly thinking before you drunk post on social yeah. media <laughs> well that's yeah that's the that's definitely one thing but i think it's it's deep bigger I mean, I, right yes I mean, no i know it's bigger i know it's bigger than that well it led me to therapy than. too you know and uh i thought that was incredible incredibly uh instructive and, and a good thing did you and, think um, you were gonna get fired were you worried i didn't i i didn't know i i honestly i didn't think it would become what it did and um right. and i kind of woke up after the weekend uh, in a haze and had a phone call that was like, dude, this is serious. And I was like, what, what is, you know, I just, I was, at, I, again, I was, it was, a, it was like after the reunion, uh, right. three nights in Montauk and then a big night right. in New York. And then you wake up on your couch and you, you realize that something's horribly wrong. You try to figure out what to do.